Oh, hello there. Mumbo transformed himself into a honey hive. Oh, God. Oh. Okay, thanks for that, sir. Okay, so Mumbo didn't accidentally transform himself into a honey hive. Instead, he's just house-sitting or something. But if we need health, we can go ahead and visit him, uh, kill his house-sitter, and get health. But now let's go ahead and kill these snowmen guys. Just be- Black. See, I told you I had to burp. Just because they get in the way. There's another Mumbo token there if you so wish to take it. And aw, our flower died. Oh well, it still has a Mumbo token there, but still. Remember that hex- that neatly cut out hexagon in the ice sheet there for later. Also, I missed. Oh man, I'm going to hit the wall. That does damage to you, by the way. Um, which is not good, obviously. You don't want to get damaged. Oh man, I was almost going to hit him head on. Well, close enough. Oh god! See, I told you I'm really bad at hitting these guys. Oh man. I just want to kill you, that's all. Come on, let me kill you. There we go, it only took getting, like, right up in his grill. Okay, I think there's one- yeah, there's one up here as well. And the Grunty Switch is actually here as well. So, yeah. And that's good, almost forgot about that. Um, even though I mentioned it, like, two seconds ago. But you want to make sure you kill that guy so you can go ahead and grab it, also. There we go, I think that should be safe. Yep. Let's go ahead and hit it. There we go, our final Grunty switch to reveal the final Jiggy of Grunty's lair. All the way up there, which is what- that's why we need to end with the B. And let's go ahead and head down here. Where are all the notes here? I forget. There are like 14 or something around here, but I can't really remember where they are. Also, we still have a guy there. I feel as though killing all of them will do nothing, but still they're annoying and they're really the only- Wow, he threw that right at the thing the flight pad, but I just still want to kill them, otherwise they'll get in my way and hurt me and stuff like that one almost did. Also, I'm still incredibly bad at hitting them. Whoa, okay, but he's not really all that bad at almost hitting me. Okay, well that's that, the dog is barking, hopefully you don't hear that, but you probably do. Um, let's just head on up, I guess. Uh, I will save going to Nati's house last, also that is not all of the guys. Well, they don't throw snowballs at you if you're really up close to them, but stuff like this will still happen. Okay, I'm going to go. I will kill that guy later and grab the notes once I can find another flight pad. For now, we're going to continue exploring. Because I don't want to accidentally, like, get knocked off by that guy and die. Also, the honey hive is all destroyed and stuff, and there's another mumbo token there if you so wish to take it. But I don't care. Still, it seems like they really did move, so maybe we'll meet up with them later. Also, I had my I had my finger on the Z button, that was almost bad. And I can't see, there we go, I can see again. Um, also, with all the snow, this is even more dangerous, I feel. Because snow is slippery, as always. Although, technically it's ice that's slippery. Okay, apparently this guy barred off his treehouse for whatever reason. However, we still want to check the top, because there are some notes there. And these four notes, I actually missed these four on my very first playthrough. These were the four that I missed. And I was searching all over Click Clock Wood in order to find them, and it was just awful. There we go, we now have 88 of our notes. And we can go ahead and head down now. Whoa, okay. That was not fun. And as always, Kazooie's Talon Trot ignores, uh, slipperiness of the snow, which is nice. Also, I missed a lot of those guys with the everything and whatnot. Also, it seems like a nabnut barred off his house. However, we can still break in and... Oh, hello there. Uh, sorry to barge in, but I just wanted to check if you had any collectibles for me. Wow, he is a heavy sleeper, okay. Well, it doesn't seem like he has anything for me. Can we break- can we break open his door? No? Okay, well, then we had to go through the window that time. Alright. My voice is going to be killing me, I just realized. <laughs> oh well. We have some notes over there by that snowman guy, which is fantastic. Luckily, he doesn't throw any snowballs when we're right by him. He's a polite snowman, but he's still impolite at times as well. I still need to find another flight pad, though, because... We need that flight pad in order to find an egg, 
uh, an empty honeycomb piece, which is actually right by Nabnut's house now that I think about it. And as well as, um, man, that guy's going to make traversing this area really difficult. Okay, there we go. Uh, as well as, um, something else that I can't remember in the slightest. Also, if I could get a straight camera angle, that would be great. And look, it's Eerie! He's a mighty eagle at, at last, and we can watch him fly. Yay, Eerie, look at him, he's so awesome looking, honestly. Okay, yeah, you can fly, although your wings are pretty small for your body. And he... He just pooed out a jiggy for us. Oh well, it's still a jiggy, although it's disgusting. And... Kazooie still ate the pooey jiggy. Also, what's our tenth jiggy around here? I forget. What is it? Is it in here? I sure hope that it's in the winter section. Because otherwise I don't remember where it is. Shoot, um... We already got the one from Nabnut. Or, yeah, we got the one from Nabnut. We got the one from Naughty. Uh, we got the one in the treehouse. The one at the very top. Um... Let's see here. Got the one from Eerie, and... The Jinjos. We got the Jinjos. Also, these guys are huge. I think they'd be smaller in the winter seasons, but I guess this place really isn't affected by the winter. Alright. Where is the last Jiggy? I honestly can't remember where it is. We got the flower. Um... Shoot. Honestly, where is it? Also, how many more notes? Four more notes. Which are the ones that are probably right by that guy that I decided to skip at the moment. Just because he's being a big fat jerk. And we also have to explore n n nab not nab nuts, naughty's area. But first, let's go ahead and go flying to get the other extra honeycomb, see if I can find the other four notes, and see if I can remember where the final jiggy is. Am I sure you don't get one for uh, killing all the guys? Not anymore. You might get one for killing all the snowmen guys. I'm going to try, because I think I remember where all of them are. I think there's three left. Um, and I hear one. Where is he? Right there. And that's where our notes are as well. Mm, let's go ahead and kill him. Oh, man, I missed. And ran right into a wall. Also, how many notes are here? I feel like... Oh, four. Good. There we go. Got him. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and grab these four notes so I can die safely. <laughs> what? What? That's almost an oxymoron. Die safely. Oh, man. Also, so many gold feathers. Too bad that are on the very edges of very slippery platforms, otherwise I might care about them. Okay, well there we go, that is all 100 notes and all of the notes in the game. So we are really getting up there on completion, we are getting near the end of the game, guys. And almost to the end of this world as well. But now I can go ahead and go in here safely, uh, just like in Rusty Bucket Bay. We lose air faster as we're underwater. So, yay for that. Also, where's his house? I feel like it's right around here. Yeah, right here. Good. Okay, we found it quickly. Luckily, we have a bit of a break. By going up here, we can refill our air. Also, whoa, did it... I think Kazooie's wings were, like, frosted over. Kind of looked weird. I'll have to look at that again. Hello there, Mr. Naughty. Even your bed is slippery. See, I wasn't touching the thing at all. Okay, well. There we go, let's go ahead, head on back under, we have to find our perfect hexagon again. But there's the very last empty honeycomb piece, but like I said a couple parts ago, the last empty honeycomb pieces, the last six, actually don't do anything. You don't get an extra unit of health for whatever reason. But they're still there in case you missed some other ones in a previous world or something. So you can miss a total of six and still get the maximum amount of health. Also, I'm pretty sure that Kazooie's wings actually do, like, the tips frost over. Okay, so that's pretty neat, if that is true. Um, I still want to check what's over by the stump. Because I feel as though, yeah, it's just a flight pad, that's what I thought. Okay, there's still the matter of that last Jiggy. I honestly cannot remember where it is right now. Hmm, I think I just lost track of all the Jiggies, and I don't remember which one I have yet to grab, honestly. Um, when I was naming them all off, I wasn't really keeping track of them. 
like how many that was or something. Let's just try killing these guys, and if that isn't it, then I have no idea. Mmm, there are no Jiggies in Mumbo's house. We got Eerie over there. There we go, there's an extra life there. Actually, I think it might be under one of these snowman guys now that I think about it. So let's go ahead and find... I think there's only one more. I feel like he'd be near the top as well. I feel like they'd put the one that has the Jiggy right by the top. Oh no. Not really, apparently. Wasn't there one by the treehouse? Did I kill that guy already? Um, Not hearing any maniacal laughter. Which is a bad sign. I want to hear that maniacal laughter. I, I just killed that guy. That's the one with the life. I feel as though there was one more that I didn't kill. Could have sworn I remember hearing slash seeing three. Unless one of those was in earlier ones that I just saw later. Ah, uh, God. Not hearing any laughter whatsoever. Maybe he's stopped laughing because he's scared. He knows he's going to die. Okay, I honestly cannot remember where this last Jiggy is. Somebody's probably shouting at me by now as to where it may be. Um... But I just... I can't hear you, unfortunately. It would be really helpful if I could, but... Unfortunately, I can't. I can't even begin to think of where it may be. Huh. Shoo, I... Wow. Just massive brain fart. This is awful. I know it's not, um, under this lake of death and stuff. Also, that extra life, do not go for it. It is so far away that you will end up dying as you attempt to get it. So it's just kind of pointless. In fact, you'll just end up losing all your notes, which if you don't have all 100 is a bad thing. Okay, so let me th let me think here. I do have yeah, 29, okay. Um I have the Jinjos, the flower, the top of the tree, the leaves, Nabnut, uh Naughty, Eerie. Two that I can't remember. Shoot. Um Ah, oh, crap, I might have to look it up and then facepalm immediately. I don't even know if it's in winter. But, I feel as though... Oh yeah, treehouse, that's eight. Um... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I... God, I can't remember, okay. I'm probably going to have to look it up, honestly, and then immediately facepalm, like I said. Um... Wow. This is fantastic. Okay, well... Let's see here. Um, if I could pause, that'd be great. Nope, pause. Game facts. Let's see here. Oh god, that's right. Okay. Yeah, we, we could get it here, but I'm just going to go get it at spring, because... God, now I remember. Okay. It's kind of a random one, but oops. I accidentally went back into winter. Okay, so... Oh man, no wonder I couldn't remember it, it's just kind of random, and I always just happened to find it. But I didn't happen to find it this time. So let's go ahead, go back into spring, because we need to transform into the bee again anyways for Gruntilda's lair and that last Jiggy in her lair. Um... So let's just go ahead, head on over to Mumbo's hut. Because we need the bee, like I've said. Still, I, I, honestly, I do remember it now. And I can see how I forgot it, honestly. It's really random, just kind of there. And there's no way that you could possibly see it unless you were just randomly flying around. Which, although I was doing, I wasn't flying around in the right place, apparently. Oh well. So there we go. I don't know everything about this game. Although I do remember it now, still, like, I forgot about it. So, man, my god, my throat is hurting so much. I honestly can't wait to stop just because my throat is starting to really hurt. Okay, let's just go ahead, head on up. Mumbo, how did you- why did you not tell me about this Jiggy? And mention like, oh hey, by the way, you need the bee to find this Jiggy, of all things. Let's go ahead, transform again. By the way, if you want the rest of my Mumbo tokens, you can go ahead and take them. I'm not going to be using them. Although I did get an even 15, and by even 15, I mean an even multiple of 5, because 15 is not an even number. Oh well, I would have liked to grab 42, 
uh, extra ones, but that would have taken a lot of work. Let's just fly all the way up, and I think I actually see it right now. Right here. Yep, this random place. Right here, with this random guy. He just happens to be here. There we go. That's the last one, and he doesn't bite you when you're a bee. Nice. There we go. We don't get to see the dance, uh, because we're a bee, which is kind of unfortunate, especially since we're going to be a bee for the very last Gruntilda's lair, uh, Jiggy, as well. Uh, so it's kind of unfortunate. Our last dance was a very long time ago. I would have really liked to have the very last dance for the very last Jiggy, but oh well, we still have some note doors to open up, a qu quite a few actually, so we will see the dance quite a bit, I guess. Okay, let's just go ahead and fly all the way up here. I think it's... Yep, right up there. Here is our final Jiggy. Okay, so right now I'm at, uh, one... An hour and two minutes about, I think. Which means I have four videos exactly. And I... Actually, I think that... Uh, this recording session was just as long as the one for Rusty Bucket Bay. But, okay, there we go. That is Click Clock Wood in its entirety. My throat is killing me. I'm going to go drink a gallon of water or something. And I will see you all next time, where we will not be a bee. Actually, let's just go ahead and show off where we're going to be next time. Uh, untransform. There we go. Let's go ahead in here. Wrong place. Oops. <laughs> well then. Um, just one last mistake for the end of the video. Oh, god, these guys. No! I thought I was done with you birds! <sighs> this is the right way, okay. Next time, we will go save Tootie. See you all then. Goodbye.